Chapter 2, Mishnah 4. All peels and shells are considered shomri, and they therefore become tame when the foods to which they are attached become tame, and they make the foods to which they are attached tame when Tuma touches them, the peel or shell, and they combine with the edible parts of the foods to make up the minimum size needed for a food to become tame. The Mishnah discusses the law for onion peels. Rabbi Huda says there are three peels on an onion, and they have different laws. The, inner, the innermost peel, which is edible, combines with the other edible parts of an onion to make up the minimum measure, whether it is whole or torn. Since it is edible, it is considered a food, and it combines with the rest of the food, even in cases where it is torn and does not serve to protect the rest of the onion. The middle peel, which is not edible, combines with the edible parts of the onion if it is whole, not torn, because it serves to protect the edible portion of the onion underneath it and is therefore considered a shomer, but it does not combine with the edible parts if it is torn because it no longer protects the onion and is not considered a shomer. And the outermost peel is tahor, i.e. it does combine, does not, i.e. does not combine, sorry, and the outermost peel is tahor, i.e. does not combine, whether it is this way torn or that way whole. The outer peel cannot be considered a shomer, even if it is whole, because the middle peel already serves this purpose.